Hi DIYers, Joe from Alarm Grid, and today we're going to talk about how to configure your August lock with Apple HomeKit. To answer your question, yes, the August lock is compatible with Apple HomeKit. There is one thing though that we do recommend that you purchase and set up before you go to set up HomeKit with the August lock, and that's the August Connect Hub. What that's going to do is it's going to allow you to interface your August lock with your Wi-Fi network. You can connect the lock to HomeKit without the Connect Hub, but the lock has to be able to communicate with your HomeKit hub via Bluetooth. And for this to happen, the hub is going to have to be within 10 to 15 feet of the lock itself, which is super inconvenient because you either need your Apple or the HomePod, your iPad, or your Apple TV that close to the lock. In most cases, this isn't going to be the case. With your Apple Connect hub, you can get your August lock onto the Wi-Fi network, which gives you a lot more flexibility of where everything else is within the house. Today, we're gonna to show you how to set it up uh, with an iPad, and we do have it connected to our August Connect. The setup process, though, is the same if you're gonna use Bluetooth or go through Wi-Fi. Interfacing this with HomeKit is a great, great thing to do as it's gonna open up a whole bunch of features to you with the lock. It'll allow you a whole bunch of different scheduling stuff, interactions with the different devices, remote control, and a bunch of other great things. HomeKit is a wonderful service and it works really well with home automation devices such as this. So let's start in the app on our iPad and show you how to set this up. So I'm gonna load up my August app. I'm gonna click on Alarm Grid Headquarters and we have our lock right here. I'm gonna click on the gear icon and then do lock settings and scroll down and do HomeKit settings. So now we're ready to set up HomeKit. So I'm gonna click on Enable HomeKit. It's telling us to remove the faceplate from the front of the lock and locate the eight digit accessory code. And for privacy concerns, I'm not gonna show you the code, but it is on the back of your faceplate. It is right up there. The little HomeKit symbol is located here and then the code is right next to it. So. On our app, we have choose which HomeKit home you want to add this lock to. I'm going to do my home. Click next. And then we'll just call it the test room, as this is a test room. We'll continue. And now it's setting up HomeKit. All right. So now I have to scan the code. And it's connecting. And as you can see, it was added. We got a little prompt on the top that says the test room lock was added. And I'm going to click done. So now that we've added this, let's go to the HomeKit app and check it out. Let's go back to the main menu. I'm going to click on home. And there we go. Right there is our test room lock. We don't have it installed on a door right now, so it isn't gonna be able to uh, function with this, but we are getting a response from the lock when we're clicking this button showing us that it is interfaced with HomeKit. If you do have any questions about your August lock, about Apple HomeKit, or integrating any of these devices, feel free to give us a call at 888-818-7728. Head to our website, www.alarmgrid.com, or give us an email, send us an email at support at alarmgrid.com. If you enjoyed the video, feel free to subscribe. And if you want to be notified when we post future videos, hit the notification button below and we'll send you an update when we do so. Have a great day and thanks for watching.